Hi, it's Paula here. Welcome to another video where I encourage people to paint no matter what. In today's watercolor tutorial, I'm sharing how I mix pastel colors like pinks and purples and using those colors you can create a landscape like this. So let's get started. For some reason, I'm into landscapes lately and I usually work creating contrast. But today I wanna try some pastel colors for a change and paint some simple pastel skies. First of all, we are gonna try work on some samples and mixing paints to make pastel colors. You can see the difference between the colors straight from the palette and the pastel colors, which are much less saturated and a little opaque. So I'll try my best to show you how I'm working. I'm going to have three samples of the same color. The first one is the color straight from the palette. The second one is a very watery mix because some people consider this kind of less saturated color as pastel colors. And third, I'm going to mix white watercolors in my paint, so it will turn pastel. The advantage of using white is that you can get an opaque color and you can create a more contrasting painting. If you use a very watery color as pastel, your painting will be very light and could be hard to paint depth or volume. You can see better the effect of pastels on vibrant colors like this magenta. When I mix the white, it turns out a beautiful pastel pink. And the violet turns out a sort of lilac. Here you can notice how less saturated and soft the pastel colors are. And using just those four colors, you also can create variations of peach pastel colors. I encourage you to play around with all those colors and I'm sure you'll have lots of fun. You can do the paint more pigmented, but if you think it's too much, you can add more white and make it lighter. The peach colors can be more to the pink side or more to the orange side, depending on what you want. Have you ever tried pastel colors? Are you gonna try it? Let me know in the comments down below. And don't forget to check the description box to get the link to my Instagram watercolor by Paula. Tag me there if you try pastel colors because I'd love to see what you're all creating. You can also get some affiliate links to have great deals while buying art supplies. Take a look! Here I'm just playing around painting some loose roses to test the colors a bit more. And here are the final samples, but of course you can make any other color turn out pastel, like blues, greens and grays. I wanted to show you how I've painted those skies, the ones that I've shown you at the beginning of this video, but for some reason I'm out of focus during all the recording process. I'm sorry about that. I'll leave you with the final painting. And that's it for this video. I hope you find this watercolor mixing tutorial helpful and if you try this tutorial, please tag me on my Instagram watercolor by Paula and I'll share your beautiful creations in my stories. Don't forget to check the description box to get the links to my Etsy store, my Instagram and also to buy great art supplies like this watercolor palette that I've used to create this tutorial. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!